I'm so proud of my babe doing her 30 day challenge. She's like been kicking butt and I'm just happy I'm able to assist. I know y'all probably like, Bella, what you gonna eat or is are you eating the same or? Simone, don't get it twisted. In fact, your plans what I be. Complexion is her she. Chocolate lady, shh, let's keep it low key. Talk with m m maybe too much G. Get the pepper from my daddy. Game be from my mama. Don't affiliate with those who owes don't have commas. Pillar ain't for those who chose to have drama. Got a meal to make, so I can load and blow. What it do, family? It's your girl Bella. And I'm back with another video. Um, today we are in the kitchen, clearly. Um, if you are new, I need you to smash that subscribe button and make sure you turn on those post notifications as well so you know every time we post a video. All right, good morning, family. <laughs> it is early. Um, my babe, too, is at the gym. Um, she's been doing this 30 day challenge and she's been sticking to it and doing really, really good. I'm so proud of her. Um, so what I am doing today uh, is doing her meal prep. Um, I've been trying to help, um, I've been trying to help my babe with her eating, you know, habits and, you know, doing healthier choices. And um, so while she's at the gym, I decided I would just do her meal prep today. Normally I'm a little bit late, like, Two days, what's today? Tuesday? I'm like two days late. Um, normally I would do her meal prep on Sunday nights for the week. Um, and then like be, have her all set and ready to go. But even though we didn't do, I didn't do her meal prep the other two days, we did have healthy choices or whatever. So we didn't do nothing bad. But so on today's menu, meal prep, oh yeah. And we got these cool containers. Um, that she ordered so that her meals, I can stack them in the refrigerator nice and easy. Um, what I did, I already have my oven preheated. This is my pan. I'm going to be cooking my boneless, skinless chicken thighs on for her. All I did was put a little bit of olive oil on the pan so that the meat doesn't stick. Um, I had seasoned, I had washed, seasoned, and marinated her chicken overnight. Um, I did this last night. Um, so I put like some fresh herb and parsley paste in there. Um, I did garlic um, and just lemon pepper. That's it. I didn't do nothing with like salts or anything like that. Just some basic good seasonings. Um, and I also use, um, what is it, Mrs. Dash. I use some Mrs. Dash because she does not have any salt in it. So this is like a Mrs. Dash house. So I went ahead, preheated the oven to 400. And now I'm about to just take my chicken and transfer it um, onto the pan and put it into the stove. I also have some frozen vegetables, excuse me, frozen veggies. I got corn and some cut green beans. I also got broccoli, but my babe's real finicky with broccoli, so I'm not even gonna stress her yet with the broccoli. I need to, you know, ease that in but i'm gonna start with some green beans and corn since it's already tuesday so i'm just meal prepping for today um wednesday thursday and friday so i think i'm gonna just do like some veggies oh yeah also sweet potatoes <laughs> My babe loves sweet potatoes. These are easy because you just pop them in the microwave and they're done. So I got to get a little bit more. She has some in there. I'm going to get a little bit more of those. Um, so I think I'm going to probably do like chicken, green beans, and sweet potatoes. Chicken, green beans, and corn. Chicken, um, chicken boats because I have the lettuce, uh, lettuce leaves um, in the refrigerator. So that's also going to be a meal and probably like a chicken salad type deal but we gonna get going get the doing how it do and you know y'all just stay tuned let me just zoom in on my chicken that's my chicken my marinated chicken
All right, you guys. So we got the chicken skinless, boneless chicken thigh in the oven and it is cooking. Um, right now what I'm doing is just boiling my water for our vegetables. Um, I'm just gonna steam the veggies for a few minutes. I'm not really even gonna season it too much or nothing like that. I'll probably probably do just like a little tiny bit of butter and give it like a little bit of flavor. Um, but no, I probably might not even do that either. Like, <laughs> cause I'm just thinking about being healthy and I just be thinking about no butter, like, you know, no seasonings like that, no salt. Like, so I be really like, clicking in my mind like how to cook for her like so it could be healthy and clean but we're gonna steam these veggies once I get ready normally if I was making it for me like or you know what I mean I would season the water put some butter in the water or whatever and let it boil down but I ain't put nothing in the water it's just water I'm letting it get hot I'm gonna dump these veggies in um, I'm gonna make her a sweet potato um, I think today's meal is probably gonna be sweet potato um corn and baked chicken um so i think i might do that for today um i'm not gonna do cook too many of these because it takes literally like seconds in the microwave to cook and it's cut it out the plastic hot fresh and ready so i really don't want to cook too much of these ahead of time when i can just pop them in the microwave day of if this is what she wants um but we got to set up her little um Mail prep canisters. Um, and since these are new, okay, we just got them in the mail and I'm a germaphobe. I'm gonna wash, <laughs> wash out a couple of these containers and I'll be right back. Thank you. All right, y'all. Turn this fan down so y'all can hear me a little bit. As y'all can see, the green beans and the corn is done. I am taking only just a little bit of, I can't believe it's not butter. And I'm just putting a little, not even a full tablespoon. I did like a half. This is Mrs. Do uh, Mrs. Dash table blend, salt free. I'm just sprinkling a little bit in here just to give her a little flavor. Up oh, and my garlic. Sorry, y'all. And garlic. Sprinkle a little. Sprinkle a little. Okay. It's fresh garlic. That's it. Just real granulated, granulated garlic, should I say. I'm just going to give this a little toss. I'm not really trying to use the... Oops. Just lost one. Not trying to use the metal inside my pans, but... I'm multitasking, multitasking. So I'm just gonna give this a little twirl in its own world, okay? Give it a twirl in its own world. All right, now these look good in season. Let's just taste one, just for GP. Good. I mean, <laughs> kind of plain, cause it ain't no salt or nothing really on there but good enough because the chicken is going to be very flavorful and um i'm pretty sure she's gonna eat this with like a sweet potato so that'll give her some flavor the chicken is still chickening in the oven so y'all stay tuned i will be back Oh, my hand's ashy. All right, you guys. As you can see, I got my clean containers. I washed them, dried them out. Um, I wasn't really sure because it's Tuesday. Oh, and I made me a cup of coffee. <laughs> Gotta have my cup of joe. Um, I wasn't really too sure um, what I was doing. Like, because it's Tuesday and Fridays, I know she be trying to eat like well, I know Friday, Saturday, Sunday, out of one of those three days, she gonna eat like something good. So I don't really wanna prep too, too much, but I'll have some stored chicken, her leftover, like, you know, whatever pieces, like if she does, doesn't choose or do choose, like, you know, she can have the option. So I'm just gonna probably make 
three males for the rest of the for the rest of the week, give or take, and then just have her little storage pot um, of leftover chicken, and she can make a meal or salad or whatever. But it smells so good in here, y'all. Like the chicken, it smells amazing. Like it's almost done. Um, it's starting to brown a little bit on the top. I'll be wanting to have like, you know, just a little crisp, a little browning on the top because it does look real pasty, okay? It looks real plain because <laughs> I didn't use, you know, all of the normal things I might have, but I, the, the chicken is still going to be busting. It smells good. Um, so, hey, <laughs> okay? Y'all, this coffee right here, this coffee right here. It's called, I don't know, well, some of y'all might know, for all my um, DR people out there, PR people, um, Cafe Bustelo, like the best amazing coffee cafe ever. Like, it's so good. Like, I'm addicted to Cafe Bustelo. Like, it's so bomb. And you gotta get the one, the leche. The leche is good. I mean, you could, I mean, I started off with the original Cafe Bustelo where you got to put your creamer and your sugar and make it, you know, as sweet or as light as you need it. But the leche, it comes with like, obviously leche milk, like it's already, <laughs> it already has like that light color to it. So I just put creamer and I don't even have to put no sugar in here, y'all. I just put cream. That's it. The Starbucks um, caramel macchiato cream. And this Cafe Bustelo Leche, muy bueno, muy bueno, so good, so good. And I was like, ooh, they had it on sale too, buy one, get one. I was like, I don't mind if I do. And it's crazy, right? Because I started off, I'm all on a tangent real quick, y'all, but while we waiting for this chicken, I started off um, drinking like, you know, donut shop or, you know, like just the regular curated brands like nothing too fancy but y'all it's like I cannot drink anything else like I have brought a box of donut shop um let me show y'all I have brought a box I brought a box of these right and as you can see it's still kind of full to the top it ain't hitting like my Cafe Bustelo. Like, it's not hitting like this. This is what it looked like. Y'all already know, the lady with the red shirt. <laughs> this is what it looks like. But this right here is like some amazing coffee. Like, I can drink it all day, every day, multiple cups. Like, I just love it. Look, this is the, the first, my other box. It's already almost empty. <laughs> Such a shame. But yeah, that coffee is busting, y'all. But anywho, yeah. I'm so proud of my babe. I'm doing her 30 day challenge. She's like been kicking butt. And I'm just happy I'm able to assist. I know y'all probably like, Bella, what you gonna eat? Or is are you eating the same? Or Bella just go with the flow. I'm just making her meal prep. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna eat for the week. I probably just dug it out figure as I go um but normally when I'm cooking like the healthy meals and stuff like that like it's for her solely um because I'm I mean I want to eat healthier but I'm not like trying to lose weight I'm actually trying to gain a little but I'm just trying to tone so but I probably do need to make healthier choices so that the body can look good you know but that's neither here nor there um but yeah I don't know I'm just kind of Tito toddling right now. I don't really know, but I just eat whatever. <laughs> I just eat because I got a fast metabolism, and I don't know. I just eat whatever. But we gonna get these meals prepped. I already did my potato in the microwave. Um, I think I'm just gonna scoop the sweet potato out for her and put it inside the bowl, just because I don't know the skin. With, yeah, I don't know. It's just that I'm weird like that, but anywho. All right, so now let's do, or do her corn. Thank you. 
All right, so here's Toots Meal Prep. Let me zoom y'all in. This is Toots Meal Prep for the week. We're probably gonna start this one today. This is her Tuesday, her Wednesday, Thursday, her lettuce bolts. I just shredded up the chicken in here. And all she, the lettuce is already cut, the bolts is already washed. All she gotta do is just load up her chicken and whatever other veggies like tomatoes or whatever else she wants on her lettuce bolts with her chicken. And then this is just the last little straggler for whatever she wanna do. Um, I can even do um, chicken salad with this little random piece if she wants a snack. Um, but this is her meal prep for the week. Looking real good. Okay. This is her meal prep for the week. Um, I'm probably just gonna um, let this cool down um, and let it sit out and cool down for a little bit um, before I put it in the refrigerator. Excuse me. She already have her meal prep for um, tonight. Her dinner's already ready. Um, as far as when she come home, um, snacks, I have plenty of fruit, just plenty of fruit in the refrigerator. Um, there's also a uh, smoothie um, that we made, a fresh smoothie that we made from yesterday um, that's in the refrigerator, but she probably ain't gonna want that. But either way it go, we got plenty of fruits, snacks, healthy options for her to choose from when she gets home from the gym. I have tons of water in there so she can just refuel with water. Um, and yeah, this was fun doing. I hope you guys enjoyed my meal prep video. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, I'm gonna catch you guys. Peace.